Welcome back to Flood of Love Games. Rom here interviewing tonight's Modern Mondays winner, Josh Schindler. How are you doing tonight? Doing really good. <laughs> Came first place, so I can't complain. I would say first place is always a sweet place to be. And what deck did you do that with tonight? Uh, tonight I was running five color creativity. An oldie, but a goodie. <laughs> I would say creativity, I know, has been uh, in the meta for a good bit now. Just uh, in and out in the top part of the meta. But definitely a deck to respect for sure. Uh, how about some of the matches of tonight? What was the easiest match of tonight? Um, tonight I played against, I would say, not easy, but I think the cards were in my favor. I played against a Rakdos Scam in round two. Um, 2 0 that one. Um, I think it really just came down to I had Ren and Six in play. I got to Besejo's Blood Moon, and it just he couldn't keep up with the snowball effect. I would say it sounds like they didn't just straight up hit you with the scam. Yeah. The classic, they opened with something normal and you just kind of grind them out with Brennan yeah. Six. It's definitely a wishy-washy for sure. I, I think that's one of those polarizing matchups where one, you know, one, one deck tends to run away with the game fairly early and it's just kind of over from there. So Makes sense. And how about tonight's uh, hardest matchup? Uh, actually, round one was probably the hardest matchup. I played against Mono Black Cabal Coffers. Uh, Mono Land Destruction, He uh, game one I got demolished by Field of Ruin and the other Land Destruction card I can't remember, um, but ultimately I was able to pull that one out with looping the Sages and um, a new card that I've been introduced to uh, from the Lord of the Ring set, which is Reprieve. Um, using that to bounce back rings, Karns, um, you know, any, any threat really. I would say you just need to buy time, especially because the curve your deck you need to be able to hit that mana point to where you can turn into a creativity into a win basically yeah and exactly. just be able to stop him from stopping you effectively it will help you get there definitely a grind fest for sure and i heard you mentioned some new cards in there that wasn't just the ring so i wanted to know what other <laughs> cards besides the one ring have you been enjoying personally from the set yeah um so I've, i have been testing out the ring in a four color uh, elementals deck but tonight i was um i was playing with the two mana reprieve which is the new Remand. Um, I, I think it's really well positioned right now. I think it catches a lot of people off guard. Um, you know, you leave up, uh, you know, non-blue mana, and people tend to go for it. And being able to catch them off guard and bounce it back to the hand, it also gets around those um, Delighted Halfling and other uncounterable spells. Um, so against, um, like, Titan, you can get around the Cavern and things like that. So I, I think it's it, really well positioned. I wanted to test it out tonight, um, and I think it, it did really well. I would say deck set definitely value that sort of tempo to buy them time, especially a deck like Indomitable Creativity, where it plays that control style of gameplay, just wanting to hit that combo finish, just yeah. not even needing to hard counter, just being able to just stop something, especially through the uncounterable, which they gave us with Delighted Halfling, and then yeah. other effects like Cavern, like you mentioned, just really coming in clutch it sounds like especially because it replaces itself like remand yeah it's just no, definitely um, and, and even in matchups like scam where you know uh, a removal spell typically won't get the job done when they evoke a grief or a fury and you're able to bounce them back to their hand they're down a card um, you get to draw, so it, it, it can definitely overperform in certain situations. Definitely good to see some more cards besides the One Ring doing well. Uh, <laughs> host, uh, Lord I'm of sure the that'll be doing well too, yeah. <laughs> for sure. Well, I wanted to thank you once more for the time for the interview and congratulate you once more on the win. Is there anyone you wanted to shout out tonight? Yeah, um, I'll shout out the guy that uh, kind of gave me the starting point for the list I played tonight. His name is Josh Angle. He's been playing Creativity for a really long time out in Columbus, Ohio. I went to the Apex Invitational with him. Um, he's a really good guy. You heard it here. Shout out to him. Well, <laughs> thank you once more. Have a good night. All right.